In the South Bay, police are now asking for help from the public in connection with a suspected hate crime against a woman of Asian descent. This was in Los Gatos. What makes this case even more disturbing, as Crown Force Rob Flatterbo tells us, is that the victim is a health care worker. As a person of both Asian and Pacific Islander descent, I have been watching with shock and dismay the continuing acts of violence and hate being directed towards people who look like me. Los Gatos Police happened. Chief Peter Desena taking to the internet this week in connection with the March 30th attack on a 40-year-old woman of Filipino descent by a man on a bicycle as she walked here along Los Gatos Boulevard near Garden Lane. She's one of our medical heroes and was dressed in her medical scrubs. Without provocation, the victim was shoved from behind, causing her to fall to the ground. As she was falling, she heard someone say, go back to expletive China. The woman was not seriously hurt, but the incident calls to mind the reason behind citizen patrols in San Jose and elsewhere in the Bay Area in the wake of other hate crimes directed at people of Asian descent. That the woman is a health care worker makes the attack that much more difficult to comprehend, says the Asian Law Alliance's Richard Conda. Obviously, we have some adults who, for whatever reason, um, have this hate and anger that's built up. and. Um, I mean, we need to just find some counseling or help people, you know, again, both the person who was victimized in this case, as well as the person who attacked her. I mean, obviously he needs some, some help because it just doesn't make sense to attack um, a healthcare worker in that way. Los Gatos police described the suspect in Tuesday's attack as a white or light-skinned Hispanic man. He wore a black or gray helmet, dark neck gaiter, a black t-shirt with white writing, and dark colored jeans. Our inquiries at a nearby gas station and other businesses turned up no surveillance video as police are calling on the public for help in this case. The hate crime investigation is in progress as we speak, but we need your help. If you were in the area of Los Gatos Boulevard and Garden Lane on Tuesday around 5 p.m. and saw anything that would help us identify and arrest the perpetrator, please contact us. We need to make sure that our family and our friends understand how important it is to report these types of incidents. In Los Gatos, Rob Flatabo, Cron 4 News.